Hello, this is Nick from Quit With Nick, wanting you to share another little mindset trick that could help you quit smoking leading up to the end of the year. Now, this might seem obvious to begin with, but it's something that I've noticed in the thousands of clients that I've seen, and the more than thousands above that that I've spoken to on the phone about quitting and helping people quit over the 13 years I've done this. Um, and that is, here's the thing to consider before choosing. You're a smoker and you've decided you want to quit and you've decided that cold turkey ain't going to do it for you so you're looking for something to quit. Now here's the really important thing to remember. The quit smoking aid is not going to make you quit. The aid doesn't make you stop smoking. What it does is the aim of the aid is to give you a feeling of control. And different aids do that to different degrees. The thing that makes you decide not to smoke is your commitment and your willingness to do what it takes to quit. That's what helps you quit. The aid is designed to address the one thing standing in the way of you being a non-smoker once you've decided to quit. The craving right? If you're a smoker wanting to quit, the only reason you're not stopping like that is because there's a craving in your chest that gets overwhelming. It feels like an anxiety and you, the only way you can deal with that is, oh, now I feel better until the next time I feel that, right? So when you're, whether you're, whether you decide to choose patch, gum, pill, spray, hypnosis, it doesn't make you decide not to smoke. Hypnosis doesn't take away your ability to make a free will decision to throw a cigarette in your lips. No quit smoking aid is going to do that for you. The aid is designed to give you a feeling. If it gives you a feeling, it gives you an opportunity. When you've got that opportunity to make a decision, the only thing that's going to stop you from saying, yeah, all right, just give me one, is how committed you are. How committed are you to stay strong rather than give in to the excuse of stress, people smoking around you, I drank too much, la la la. So just an important insight. You will always make the decision whether to smoke or not. The aid is there to give you a feeling of control. Now I know from having seen literally thousands of smokers that my process can really give you that opportunity to exercise a decision and a choice. But if you want to know more, you know, there's more videos here, my number, you'll see somewhere, give me a call, happy to have a chat. This is Nick from Quit With Nick. Take care to your health. Bye.